Hey guys, it's your best boxing fans. I'm Kelsey. This is Rachel. Rachel Deontay Wilder is going to fight Dominic Friesel. Friesel? Brazil, sorry. Rachel, Dominic. <laughs> Rachel, WBC heavyweight champion Deontay Wilder, says, Screw Tyson Fury, I'm going to fight Dominique Brazil. <laughs> it takes me forever to say that. Dominique Brazil. Um, I've seen Dominique Brazil fight since he first came up as a young fighter. He's a former college football quarterback, but he still has the size. Like, he was like a taller version so he doesn't he didn't play for like a big score or anything like that but he was you know shows the kind of athletic ability he kind of has now inside the ring he does not have the kind of athletic ability that Dante Wilder has but still it's his mandatory defense he's got Brazil has one loss to Anthony Joshua by knockout so we can at least gauge how he does versus Wilder versus how he does against Joshua. Rachel, on a scale to zero to 100,000, how hyped are you about Wilder versus Brazil? It's not official yet, but it's probably going to happen. Um, I'm going to say 50,000. 50,000. Okay, let's scale. I don't even know. I can't do that math. <laughs> on a scale of zero to 10. Five. So you're about half. Why are you excited about it? I thought you'd tell me like a one or a two. <laughs> So tell me, why are you, why do you feel it's a five out of ten? Well, because, I mean, um, I'm interested in the current heavyweight division. Yeah. Uh, Wilder is a good fighter in that he's athletic. So it's not like I'm going to watch, like, a couple of overweight guys in the ring. That I wouldn't be excited about. Um, uh, so the opponent would be, like, similar. So, you know, he can't fight Tyson Fury. I don't think the Anthony Joshua fight would get made right away. I mean, obviously, Anthony Joshua is fighting Jarrell Miller. Yeah. So, yeah, let's just fight somebody else. At least, if I can't see the top three guys together, I might as well see you against, like, some other people. Yeah. And who and else is out there for Deontay Wilder to fight? Brazil's earned the opportunity. He's fighting who he's supposed to fight for the WBC to become the mandatory challenger. Um, here's the thing about that fight, though. He has no real legitimate shot to beat Wilder. Mm -hmm. Brazil is, in my eyes, a decent heavyweight, but I wouldn't even call him a serious heavyweight contender. I don't see anything in him that tells me that he could become a heavyweight champion and win any of the belts. Now, maybe he could win a secondary WBA or tertiary WBA. WBA has like so many belts, who knows? <laughs> maybe he could win something like that. But when I see a guy who isn't, a super athlete, but still fights in a clunky, difficult manner. I think he is kind of peaked. Now, that's there's nothing wrong with that. He's had a really good career, especially if you consider what um, he's accomplished in fighting Anthony Joshua before and getting this title opportunity against Deontay Wilder. We, boxing needs guys like that. He's been calling for the fight. Um, Rachel, I want you to prognosticate, because you're great at this. How soon do you think Wilder stops Brazil, having not really even watched Brazil? <laughs> that That's like the, you know, the thing um, you hate when somebody's like, and you're, like, I've never seen, like... You've seen a fight. You just I've seen him fight. I just don't remember. He's, he's, so, no, that's that's the kind of fighter he is. New Rachel's watchers, seen him and doesn't... Like, she, she I don't him. have a great memory for sports. Especially if they don't leave an indelible, like, impression on you. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I don't recall Dominique. Dominic. Dominique Brazil. Dominique Brazil fighting. So my guess would be, given the sit up, setup for the situation, is that uh, I'm going to call a round three knockout. Round three knockout. You heard it here first. Bet your house on the matter. Go to, well, you want to use the legal bookie, so you have to be in New Jersey or some other places in the United States that have that. But listen, Rachel knows her stuff. She, no, she hasn't seen Brazil fight. <laughs> she doesn't, or she doesn't remember it. But I tell you what. Lock, stock, and barrel, Deontay Wilder, round three knockout over Dominic Brazil. And then you can like, comment, and subscribe to Real Talk with Kelsey and Rachel. We love you. We appreciate you watching. We don't know. We just thought we'd make a quick video on Saturday. Maybe it wasn't a great idea. I don't know. But maybe you can make it a great idea by like, comment, and subscribing.